Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Power Falcons Let's Play Extravaganza, where we are playing Sim City today. New session, which means a new color scheme. Let's head over to the filter. It's vintage. Oh, isn't that that se sepia? Oh, no, it's not. It's kind of washed out. That's kind of gross. Let's try something not platinum. Grayscale. Even worse! You know what? Let's go with vintage. Why not? Okay. So, um... I simulated out a few hours, uh, and the gift has not arrived yet from Lee Dozer. So unfortunately, Guth Dragon's Den is still hurting here. Um, only 27,000. Um, and we do not have the money to, uh, we don't have the money to turn on all the services. So, um, I am aware that there is a glitch where sometimes the money doesn't come. So we're going to go ahead and proceed with this town as if it won't, and hopefully it will eventually. Uh, so the current plan, if we look at our population menu here, you see that we have 3,212 unemployed people. Now, um, Economics 101 says make sure you are taking in, or you are generating money if you're going to be spending a lot. So since we have so many unemployed people, and I've closed down pretty much everything here, we're going to start opening some things up again. Now, water is a severe problem. Uh, we don't have enough... Well, um, no, I'm not going to buy any. I'll, we'll generate our own. So we need how much water here? We need 67 kilogallons, which is 30, let's see, it's 10, 11, it's, it'd be 12 water towers or one water pumping station. But we need a Department of Utilities, which we have except I've shut it down. So we need the water too badly. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're going to, um, we're gonna go ahead and buy some water from all three of our neighbors. Um, even though I just said I wasn't gonna do that. But we're gonna do that just long enough to get ourselves organized and so we can start um, uh, producing, so our buildings don't start dying on us. And let's see, we. Okay, I do have a water pumping station. Why the f Ha 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 ha. Closed. Need to open Department of Utilities. I see. Okay, and I closed the Petroleum HQ. Sewage problems, I don't care. One problem at a time, ladies and gentlemen. One problem at a time. Do we have any oil wells that are operating at the moment? We have one oil well that's technically operating, but it has no water, so it can't. Although we are going to start pulling some water here. Wow, just about everything is closed due to water problems. Okay, now where is City Hall? Did I, did I blow up City Hall? No, here's City Hall, okay. I closed it, and opening it will start running me in the red, I think. Yeah, so we can't let that happen. So we're just gonna keep buying water for the for now. Um, sewage is hurting business. Um, and man, if that gift doesn't arrive, we are gonna be in some serious trouble. Because uh, right now we're basically drawing all of our money from taxes. Um, so we have to start turning on services, but we have to turn them on slowly. The garbage dump is still functioning, so that's a good thing. What do you want? Will you offer me money for something? Need more garbage trucks. That is an expense we cannot afford. Crime pays go evil. Oh, dude, you have no idea how tempted I am. But no. Just no. Okay. Now, the university is the really bad one. I, I, I don't like that one being closed. I don't like the grade school being closed. But we're going to have to just deal with a whole bunch of problems um, until we can get this thing stabilized. And we can get it stabilized once we get the water turned back on, and then we can start getting the oil wells working. Then we can draw an income, and then we can start turning on services again. 
Now, the other thing I'm planning on doing, but I'm not going to do at the moment, is I'm actually going to start downgrading these roads. The roads that are coming off of the avenue. And I'm going to downgrade them into uh, medium density. Because I think the reason our population is bolstered so high here is due to the fact that these are all high density. Um, but that's leading to the 4,000 unemployed jobs. Or the 4,000 unemployed people, rather. Um, and I need to work with that. If you're going to talk, Akamura, you need to be mic'd up. Because I can't react to you if no one even knows what you're saying. So, man. So, we need to be making... Uh, we need to be making a profit of 1700 an hour so I can... Wait a minute, can I... What else do I have here? I have... Is that the Department of Education? Okay, what if we turn on City Hall, but we turn off the Department of Education, and we turn off the Department of Safety? Then I'm only losing $8 an hour. Okay, so then we're going to turn on the water pump, and we're going to stop buying water once it starts operating. Now, see, I learned my lesson. I'm not going to turn off buying water yet. So we're losing 608 an hour, but we'll be able to start producing crude oil again. I think that will offset it, and I think we'll be all right in the short term. And hopefully uh, the gift from Lady Dozer will come. Now, if you guys um, can help me out here, let me know. Am I losing my mind, or can the gift, should the gift appear any time? Or is it one of those things where if you're gifting money to a city, it only appears at midnight? Because if it only appears at midnight, then we've got nothing to worry about. King of the Fairies. Excuse me. Fairy Terminal. I am not drawing in tourists here, buddy. It's just not going to happen right now. I have some land that I'm not using, like, right in here and right in here. Oh, I remember. I, I left this land alone because eventually I will probably put a dormitory over there once we get the university operational again. Now, Commander's Corner and um, Engelin, New Engelin don't necessarily have to be stabilized when we move on to the second quadrant. I might stabilize them off camera. Um, but Guth Dragon's Den has to be stabilized because if it isn't, then we're going to lose our university and I'll just have to build a second one later. Pyro Falcon and Leedozer stop sending water to me. Why? Oh, because we're producing our own now. Okay, that's fine. Right, is that is that what's going on? Pumping water to the city, 25, 33, yeah, okay. Is there, do I have two pumps? Why do I have two pumps? Let's turn one of them off. See where that leaves us. Yeah, okay, that works. That's good. And now it's raining, so that gets the water table back. Can barely see it. All right. What's ha what, what's the problem here? Too much sewage. Okay, that's. Fine. And what is rubble? I do not see rubble anywhere on the map. Ah. Wow. It completely collapsed due to too much sewage? Dude, that is a lot of sewage, man. Okay, so... Okay, our water problems are fixed. So we are going to stop buying from the other three cities. We're still losing a little bit of money, but now... Yes, our oil well is now functioning. Okay. Crude oil under the building, two months supply. Two months supply, ugh. Oh well. Well, let's start opening them back up. So that should help out the job count here. Still 3,500 unemployed poor people. There are still a lot of jobs available for medium and high wealth, but it's, again, one of those things that if we, oh, you know what? I could make this area medium wealth. It probably will wind up being medium wealth anyway, won't it? No? Surprisingly not. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay, so the Department of Education is down. That's gonna have to, oh, okay, we have a fire. Or is that one of those glitch fires? I think that's a glitch fire. Because the fire department, yeah, the fire department's ready to respond. Um, and given that the traffic is better, I'm gonna shut down one of the garbage truck, or fire station garages, that's what I meant to say. And if, eventually I may just blow it up. Uh, police station seems to be okay other than sewage problems. Okay, now, do I have any sewage solution at all here? No, I have no sewage solution at all. Okay, so sewage outflow pipe, I would need like three of them. Or that, or... That's good. Okay, we're sending all of our sewage to New England. Right? Is that what just happened, or did something just glitch like crazy? Using zero kilogallons an hour of 55 for zero money. Treatment capacity. Right. Okay. Right. All right. So we're set here. So New Angolan takes the poo. I've, I've always said Chris Angle is the shit, but I totally did not mean it that way. No regrets. You won't regret this. Dr. Vu is threatening the region. We need Maxis Man. No. Already have too little money as it is. Okay, so garbage should be solved. Or sewage, rather, should be solved. Yes, it is. Eventually the sewage. Yes, yeah, sending sewage to New England. Okay. And now we're getting the yellow alert that we are running in the red. Two more hours until midnight. Hopefully that gift will transfer by then. Okay. So let's check our trade depots. Storage full. Of fuel? Wait, whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, wait a minute here. Hold on a sec, wait, what? I thought I changed all those over to plastic. All right, where's our, um? there we go, there's our trade deep. It's got TVs. Okay, we're going to blow that up because we, we do not need or want TVs anywhere near this city. That's what got us into trouble in the first place. And I can't plop that because I don't have the thing open. Ugh. Uh, okay, where else do we have trade depots? Do I just have the one? I just have the one. Okay, I'm going to see if I can cheat. So we're going to pause time. We're going to open the petroleum HQ. Now can I buy the fuel? I cannot. Let's unpause. Let me guess, it has to have somebody in it, right? Yeah, probably it has to be running. We need that money too badly. It has a little bit of plastic it's doing. I need to... Okay. So I'm hoping we don't run too much out of money. I am exporting crude oil, correct? Yes, I'm exporting crude oil. And pla Wow, price of plastic has gone up. That's good. Okay. Petroleum HQ approval shared with Let's Play SimCity. So that means, does that mean it's open now? Yes, okay, so now we plop the fuel thing. We will export fuel at 21,000 per. Yeah, I, I need to just concentrate on plastic. We can't afford the switch over. Like I can't, I can't switch over the refinery right now, but I can't afford to really run it. I don't know why it was complaining to me that I, uh, I don't know why the refinery refinery was complaining to me that there was no storage capacity when there was no storage capacity anywhere, but whatever. What is this? Not bit enough room to increase density. Uh, okay, tell you what. 
That I can actually fix. So we're gonna, oh, it is this one? Wait a minute. Yep, it's that one. So we're just going to, to delete those two roads. Now we should have enough room. Maybe. We'll see. Yeah, see, this is going to stay closed because I have it closed. So, uh, what's the point? Okay, ten more minutes until midnight. Hopefully the thing comes. 750 an hour. So we'll be bankrupt in ten hours. However, if we can start exporting our industry, it will counter counteract the red. Now, if we can get the half million dollar gift, everything will be fine. Half million? Half million? Ah, oh, you suck. Well, that money just might be in the ether for now, and I may have to send another gift. That sucks. I was sort of depending on the second bailout. Okay, well, um, we'll, we'll roll with that. Ugh. Oh, Ugh, that still hurts, though, man. Six months supply. Wait a minute. 23 months supply. Oh, I wonder if those don't have enough uh, people working at them yet. Still have 2,200 unemployed. You would think that the game would report to me how many... Um, you would think it would report to me how many people are in the building. Is there a, is there a jobs map? I don't think there is. Population... Workers. 16 workers. 679 workers. What is that building? Oh, it's a... It's an industrial zone. 37 workers. But it's not telling me what the maximum number is, so I don't know if this... how many workers this oil well can contain or can have. It's kind of annoying. 50 workers. And I'm about to hit the wall in water, aren't I? Yep. Okay. Well, like I said, one thing at a time. So we have the oil. The oil refinery is working. Apparently there was a delivery of fuel. Yes, there's now a thousand barrels of fuel at the trade depot. Hopefully it can start sending that because as soon as the as soon as the fuel gets exported we'll be in pretty good shape for a little while i stress for a little while we only had one transaction recently and the bonds are killing me too the bonds if i could if i could wipe out the bonds then i would be only losing about 250 an hour which is not shabby but well, not much I can do here except cross my fingers and hope. Let's see. Okay, Commander Corners workers filling local jobs. Why? We have two thousand unemployed people. Why do we need Commander's Corner to send any workers this way? Commander. Commander's Corner Shoppers finds deals in Guth Dragon's Den. Well, that's good. I'm like, I'm wanting to go to triple speed as I usually do, but I'm kind of afraid to right now. Why are these buildings not building? They've just been kind of sitting here. I wonder if they're bugged. No, that just jumped. Okay, so it's just taking a while. I see. Once those buildings come up, I'll get a little bit more money in taxes. So, if you guys ever wondered what knife edge budgeting looks like, this is knife edge budgeting. I'm just perpetually on the brink of losing everything. Hard. Ugh. Okay, well, um, thanks for watching, guys. We're going to uh, keep hoping we pull this off. Um, I think I've got it. I think we're, s we're not stable, but I, I think we'll keep making profits, and I think we'll be all right, so... Um, we'll see how it goes. Um, 
And we need the we need the city hall to get upper. Oh, that's that blinky red is not good. Well, we'll tackle that hopefully in the next episode. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you tomorrow.